still got the knife, too. There must be more things I need to open. Oh, oh. In the name of the Lord, end this game! Everything is locked. Another cupboard! Another fucking cupboard! <laughs> More white blocks! Do I have enough now? Do I have enough now? Let's do it! Let's do it! Do it! There aren't words to describe my fury for this game. Alright, I have spent way too much time on this than anyone should ever have to spend on a game. Ever! Let's do it! Fuck you, Holmes. Fuck you! Every which way! This puzzle sucks. Its design sucks. Its execution sucks. It's just... This is the most god-awful puzzle I have ever seen in my life. It's so bad, the designers actually put in a way to cheat to get around it. You're supposed to click up in this corner here, click there a few times, then you're supposed to dot on a couple of icons, and then it's supposed to solve itself. But it never works! God, I hate this puzzle. Let's do it! Shut up! Okay, here's how the puzzle supposed is supposed to work. Up here you have the icons, it's supposed to tell you how many of each color block there is. It, first of all, you have to suss out which color block you're supposed to use, which color it is that the numbers correspond to, and then how many of each block go where go. Where the blocks go, you have to figure that out. You're only given how many blocks go in each column. You have to figure out systematically how many, where the blocks go, and you'd never figure that out unless you know what the picture is. Even every walkthrough I looked on this game says that this puzzle is part skill and part pure luck if you don't know what you're trying to make. It's just insidious. And the image that you're making here is absolutely ridiculous as well. The only way I ever managed to solve this puzzle was to go online print out a sheet that detailed me exactly where each block goes in a grid pattern. This grid pattern it was the only way I ever managed to beat this damn thing, and even then, it didn't accept it the first two times I tried it. So this is try four here. I know it works. I know I've got a system that works here. It's just, it takes for fucking ever to do it. Let me see if I can suss this thing out here. Okay, let me think. Start, uh, so four. Okay, black block four. To... Yeah, the main part of this thing is just trying to fill in the outline, and then you just gotta basically fill in backspace. White blocks are your background, and the dark blocks are the actual shape that you're going to make. While I'm filling this in, I'd just like to remark that the actual shape that you make, for being a game, makes absolutely no sense at all. Because, I mean, you've been in an Egyptian... You, you, you've been in the Egyptian area for, you know, a good... You know, well, the entire goddamn game, you've been playing Egyptian. You know, it's a Sherlock Holmes game, but it's an Egyptian theme. So you'd think that the main symbol would be something, you know, Egyptian? Because, you know, that's what everything else has been in this game? But, no. No, the most... heinous... heinously random... Image. Well, I can't say random, but you just have to see what see for yourself. About the only good thing I can think about this puzzle, the only somewhat decent thing about this puzzle, is the fact that if you me do mess up and you know, put a square in the wrong spot, you can just use another the other color to white it out, which is a fucking godsend because you will be messing up a lot on this puzzle. If, it, if, it, if the game had made it so that when you put down a block it was fixed, this puzzle would be virtually impossible to do, because you need to do every single icon 
exactly right. And believe it or not, this cursor is actually a little bit awkward to use because the blocks don't always go with the end of the uh, wand there. Sometimes they go with the finger, sometimes they go... I'm not exactly sure where exactly my mark is to use this thing. It's just very confusing and very disorienting. Very... I don't want to say disorienting. Disorientating. Um, looking for here. Uh, stupid to use. Let's use that word. Yeah, stupid. It seems to be a suitable word. This game is just so fucking ridiculous. Damn, messed up. See? See, right there. I would have like, totally been screwed over if I couldn't put these parts back. I know it seems like I'm trying to find, you know, what there's just one good thing about this game, and I really do. I don't like, you know, just beating down on these games just because it doesn't seem fair, because, you know, people did some work on this, I guess. You know, there had to have been at least a, a very mediocre effort at best, but so, so someone did something to this game, and, you know, it's, it's not right of me to, you know, just uh, repeatedly beat down on that because they really didn't do anything, but still, it, it, I, I try to be fair. I really do try to be fair, but sometimes games are just so fucking bad! I swear, that pipe is like the worst part of the entire puzzle, getting that pipe to look right. Because it has to be exactly at the right area, exactly. You know, just so. Damn it. I was never a fan of coloring as a child. I really wasn't into that. I'm like, okay, I got an image here that looks nice, you know? Black and white. I'm fine with that, you know? I'm a manga guy. I always have been. You no. Know, I guess I admit it's black and white, but still, it's fucking coloring. I hate that. This game finds everything that I hate and just makes me do it. Numbers, coloring. Ugh! That thing was custom tailored to piss me off. And there you have it. That's the shape that we're looking for. To the great Egyptologist, his final grand puzzle of the game is Sherlock Holmes' profile. I, I, I can't even... Okay. What are you doing? That should be it. I'm not supposed to click out of this thing. I'm supposed to just start it, and then it's supposed to go. Come on, I filled it in right. Everything... It's filled in right! The fuck? It's supposed to change. It's supposed to say simplicity itself as soon as I fill in the last block. I'm not supposed to back out of this thing, otherwise it'll just restart. Fuck! It looks exactly like the picture, I swear! Did not mess this up. What? Oh, please don't tell me I have to do that and have to start all over again. Oh, please don't make me do that. God damn it. Son of a bitch! Let's do it! Again! Really? You're gonna make me do the entire thing over again? God damn this game! You did this the last time too! It never lets you do it the first time. It never fucking lets you do it the first time. God, fuck. The really sad thing about this, this is now like the fifth time I've put in this thing. Because I actually did this like twice before, and I actually got it to work. But... I wasn't recording. I didn't have the thing recording because I was just playing around with it and trying to get the thing to work out of desperation. It just magically happened. It's gonna be like the one in like one billionth chance that it actually worked and I wasn't fucking recording it and I didn't... 
Man. All right, let's try it one more time. Come on! Oh. Wait. Oh, no, wait, the pipe is wrong in it. All right, hang on, hang on. So four plus one, two, so that's four. Pipe should stop at two. Stops it. Yeah. All right, let's go down a little bit. It is obvious. Bingo! 